There are many horrible places on Earth. Many places that people despise. Like Walmart on Black Fridays. The DMV. And the worst of them all. Public bathrooms, dog. Oh my god. I think it's safe to say that public bathrooms can be not bad or a fat miss. Like, it's one or the other. Like, sometimes I'll be going into the public bathrooms in the fancy-ass restaurant. And they got the most nice, clean, spotless bathroom I have ever seen. You think you would turn on the sink and then gold just starts pouring out but those are outliers for the most part they're fucking trash and today i decided to make an entire video ranting about it because i have nothing better to do now first things first when you walk into a public bathroom the smell all right the smell is gonna be fucking trash and i mean first of all stepping foot into a public bathroom you're kind of just asking for it you're asking for the world war ii of shits to just hit your nostrils real quick that's essentially what it is think about it if it wasn't an emergency they would go at home but oh it it's an emergency bro trust so yeah the copious amounts of trucker shits hit your nose and then all of a sudden so let's say you gotta take a piss you go to the urinal you take the one on the right there's a guy standing on the left side and then god forbid if somebody goes in that middle urinal it's on site with little bro because i don't know who's doing that taking a urinal between two dudes that's crazy bro i'm not gonna lie like even in the most crowded bathrooms bro like i just can't do it there's no way especially when there's no borders bro like it's just a crime it's an unspoken rule most people know not to do that like at this point bro it is bathroom etiquette i kid you not there is literally a buzzfeed quiz on which urinal you would take which urinal you should pee in come on you guys know this editor put the jeopardy music and give them five seconds If you said the one next to the two dudes, you're correct. Pause, pause, da, 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 da. The one in the middle. And that is the only one you should have thought about taking. But bro, if you take the urinal next to me, please at least just lock in and look forward. Do not look down, bro. Like, that's just weird as fuck. Like, Lil Bro, I'm trying to pee and you're putting me in a pissing stalemate? Like, get the fuck out of here. But yeah, a pissing stalemate is like the worst situation you can get into in a public bathroom. Because first of all, you already don't want to be there. And you got a shy boy bladder and it won't empty like that is one of the most unfortunate events that can occur and also please do not be that fucking guy that just whistles when he's taking a piss please bro that shit is so annoying like nah shit like that really distracts me from the lock-in bro like i gotta stay locked in and empty the bladder you know what i'm saying but god forbid let's say you gotta take a shit all right unfortunately it is what it is god said you know what fuck your stomach y you're gonna have to take a shit in a public bathroom and that's what happened Happen. And if you, yes, you watching this video, does not put toilet paper around the seat before sitting down, you are a crazy human being, bro. I'm not gonna lie. How, how do you do it? Like, I know that doesn't do much, but you know what? I can at least pretend that it does. Like, every time I sit down on a public toilet, bro, like, I feel like I'm gonna get some kind of infection. Obviously, not the most ideal situation, but at this point, you just gotta pray to God that nobody walks into that bathroom. Like, you really gotta sit there and pray that no one walks in. In, especially if it's a school bathroom like if somebody walks in while you're taking a shit right there is a chance that you will be harassed in that stall because some people take videos of themselves on tiktok harassing people in stalls while they're taking a shit like bro just let them take a shit in peace goddamn like me personally i would not let that one go i'm not letting it slide like this dude's lucky i don't throw the fucking toilet paper with shit on it right at him like genuinely bro that shit is so fucking annoying like i've seen tiktok of kids literally like banging on the stall door and like yelling at the kid taking a shit in there and he was over there like well i know you're taking a shit in there like bro shut the fuck but yeah man i guess it's a cruel world we live in can't even shit in peace but if you're in a school bathroom you also gotta hurry it up you gotta pick up the pace because your teacher's gonna get mad at you if you were gone for too long like bro i can't exactly calculate the speed of my colon bro like the teacher's over here like make it quick make it quick like, shut the hell up with your make it quick looking ass. Like, they're over here trying to have me do a bathroom speed run any percent, bro. Like, that's just not happening. But then you flush the toilet, but then you realize there's no toilet paper left. What do you do? I don't know if this has happened to any of you guys in the comments, but it has never happened to me, thank God. Like, I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy, bro, getting stuck in a public bathroom without toilet paper. Like, no one trying to walk around with dookie stains. Like, nah, we need the toilet paper. Like, if the janitor sells the 
bag on me, bro. That would be so tough. Like, if he forgets to refill the toilet paper thing, it is wraps. But in most situations, that doesn't happen. So you finish your business, you get out of the stall, then you start washing your hands. And then there's somebody who walks in with a vape pen. There's always that one fucking guy every single time, bro. Most people have them on them nowadays, bro. Like, I'm hearing, like, even people who are, like, really young are vaping now. Like, are they doing a life speed run? Like, what age are they trying to live until? People vaping at goddamn 11 years old, bro. Look, do they want black lungs by 35? I don't know what they're shooting for there. But despite that, this dude starts to fucking hotbox the goddamn bathroom. And now it smells like fucking strawberry mango or whatever the hell it is. Or guava ice, bro. Like, hell nah, dog. I'd rather smell the bathroom must at that point. Just like inhaling that smell just makes me feel kind of sick. And as you're washing your hands, you realize something one of the soap dispensers is fucking missing and the other one is out of soap like being in a public bathroom after the the lick challenge yeah sometimes bro like you could just expect a soap dispenser to be gone i guess people think that's a cool thing to do like just take a fucking soap dispenser like what are you even gonna do with it i, I don't fucking know but anyways bro yeah sometimes the janitor be selling on the soap dispensers too or sometimes there's that one fucking kid that just presses the soap dispenser so much and he wastes all the guys damn soap like come on dude i'm not trying to have musty guys hands over here but after that you rinse your hands off and then you look for a paper towel dispenser there is none and you got to use a fucking air dryer the air dryers are so trash bro they're terrible like they don't dry shit like they really don't like all it really does is move the water around it doesn't do anything like the paper towels are so much better unless they're just really thin but you know what at least it actually absorbs the water so your hands will actually dry you go to leave the bathroom but you don't want to touch the doorknob all right i got a trick for you for this one just wait for somebody else to open the door or grab a paper towel and touch the door that is a hundred percent guaranteed method that you will not have to touch the doorknob because at this point the doorknob may just have the same amount of fucking germs as a toilet but upon entering a public bathroom that's not even the worst type of situation you can run into there are so many situations that you do not want to get into in a public bathroom you could open in the stall and the toilet could just be dirty as hell like shit and piss stains on it and other stains yeah i don't want to get into that one like if that were to ever happen to me i just pick a different stall because there is no way i'm going in that one and i pick the one that's the least dirty but i mean if you go into a public bathroom you're kind of setting yourself up for failure already yeah bro just going in there already is an l my first year of college i lived at this school and bro i had, had to use the college bathrooms bro there'd be hangover throw up in that bitch and even worse bro yeah we had to also shower in there so you could really only imagine what remains were in the showers like it was tragic bro i'm not even gonna lie to you like there would sometimes be that dude that tries to talk to you when you're taking a shower like bro what the fuck like listen bro respectfully we are both butt ass naked right now like can we save the conversation for another time bro i never understood that one dude i'm not gonna lie but there is somebody there is a creature so foul that I will never, ever, ever understand. The school beater, bro. Can you not wait the rest of the goddamn day? Like, really? Like, clearly, bro, you have no self-control if you're in school doing that shit. Like, honestly, you shouldn't do that in the first place, but dude school really bro out of all places and sometimes little bro's got the volume up and you can hear it like it's bad i've only ran into this phenomenon once and it was bad bro and some people were messing with the kid and honestly yeah he was getting rightfully clowned in that moment bro so yeah bro that's a lesson for you school beaters out there bro don't even bother don't even try to explain yourself in the comments bro you criminal as hell but yeah public bathrooms yeah they're fucking trash but sometimes bro i just gotta go there's no holding it like if Chipotle hit a little bit different last night, bro. There is nothing I can do about that. 